I just got in this Sunapex 5 watt solar battery maintainer for 12 volt batteries. I have the perfect place for this, but it can also be used for boats. If you have a fishing boat and uh, you don't always get out there and get it charged up good, you can hook this thing up and that will maintain that 12 volt deep cycle battery. Perfect for tractors, boats, RVs, your vehicles that you don't drive very often, or if you have a 12 volt battery that you use for camping, that's what I use it for. Let me show you different ways to hook this thing up. Let's get it opened up first. Like a nice panel. Has large alligator clips to attach to your battery post. And you can plug this in to your cigarette lighter of your vehicle and that will maintain your battery through your charging system without having to hook it directly to the battery. Now what we're gonna to wanna to do is you wanna plug in your alligator clips to this plug right here. And if we was gonna plug that into your cigarette lighter adapter or your power point, you would use this and plug it in right there. However, in this scenario, we are going to use these alligator clips. So we want to plug this in just like this. You got a little wire to work with. Make sure you have your solar panel setting in the direct sunlight to get the full absorption of the solar. Sitting right there would work great. And always, always remember, red goes to red and black goes to black. It's positive and negative. So you have your positive here, your negative here, Hook up your negative. Then hook up your positive. If you can notice, we have a green light indicating we are getting solar and it is charging. If that green light is not on, you need to move your solar panel into more sunlight. This is great for maintaining your battery if you're not gonna be using your vehicle much. Or if you have a boat, like I said a while ago, if you have a boat, it's great for that. If you'll notice, there is a red light on this solar panel. That means we are getting solar, but it is not charging, obviously, because we do not have it hooked up. If we had it hooked up, you would see the green light like we saw a while ago. That's just an indicator that it is getting solar.